Is learning the English language your toughest challenge yet? Become our student and get access to effective and free educational materials. Damn it! I'm running out of money again. I really need to balance my budget and handle my money better. You did spend too much, and most of the expense was kind of unnecessary. But I make it. No, you don't have to spend every penny you make. You could save some every month, like a lot of other people do. I work hard so I deserve to enjoy, but that costs money. You should save in case of an emergency. You need to have more self control. What things did you spend money on? The problem is that I have no idea. I didn't pay attention. Let's bygones be bygones. Start saving right now. Bob, how about joining the boxing club this summer vacation? What a good idea. So let's get registered tomorrow. Okay. Tom did me many favors. For example, everything is now. I'm kind of sick of it. Each ring has three small diamonds inside the band. Ew. One for each of the zeros in 2000. Wow. Stop making fun of me. So find a guy to marry and you can get one. I don't need a guy to buy a wedding ring. Oh, I see. You're going to wear one and pretend you're married to try to attract guys. How do you do? I'm Parker. How do you do, Mr. Barker? Parker. Oh, Parker with a P? Yes, with a P. Er, I'm Barker. Barker? With a B, of course. Yes, with a B. Won't you come in, Mr. Barker? Thank you, Mr. Parker. What sports do you think women excel at most? I think women excel in every sport except the ones that are taboo for us to join in, like football. I mean which ones are they better at than men? Why do you care? Women and men are different all around. I don't think they can be compared. That's a good point. Let me change my question. What sports do women like best? Well, I know some women who love golf and I know others who love contact sports. Are you saying that women can't be generally categorized? Are you suggesting that anyone can be? Hello? Is that Mark? How are you? I haven't heard from you in ages. I've been overseas, so have you been busy lately? Pretty busy. So are you back for good? Yes, I was just wondering when you'd have time to go fishing. Well, I'm not working on the weekend, so we could grab some beer, ice in our fishing rods, and head out to the river. That sounds good. I've missed you, my friend. Same here. The new web page design is much more effective than before. I feel confident it will rope in a lot more business because of its user friendly format. Why do you think the new page is so much better than the old page? I thought the old page wasn't half bad. The old page was okay, alright, but there wasn't a big influence in our sales volume because the site wasn't developed with an eye towards the marketing aspect. Now it's different. We got our marketing department team in on the action, and the results are smashing.
What changes were made from the old page to the new page? First, the visitors to the site are encouraged to give their contact information. They can sign up for a free monthly drawing. Once we've got their info, it goes into a database for future marketing mailers and advertising targeting. Also, there are clear links to descriptions of our products and services, so as to give confidence to new customers. We also added a specific area for online customer service. So far, we've gotten a ton of positive feedback. Great. It's a lovely day out today, isn't it? It's beautiful. Enjoy it while it lasts. It's supposed to get cold tomorrow. What's the weather forecast for tomorrow? It's supposed to snow early tomorrow morning and then tomorrow afternoon there's a chance of freezing rain. That doesn't sound pretty. Do you have any plans for tomorrow? Well, I was going to drive to Birmingham to see some friends. You might want to change your plans. With the cold and wet weather that we're supposed to have tomorrow, the roads are going to be rather slippery. I suppose I should. I don't like driving in dangerous weather conditions. Do you have any plans for tomorrow? I just have to go to class tomorrow afternoon. If you're lucky, it'll get cancelled and you can have a snow day. If that happens, then I'll invite you over and we can drink hot cocoa and watch movies. That sounds like fun. Hey, look outside. It started to drizzle. English weather is even more predictable than I had previously thought. In the discus throw, you scored 30 meters at the final throw. How did you make it? Well, I've been practicing for five weeks. Is this your best score? No, once I did 32. Happy birthday, Alice. Here is a little something for you. Thank you very much, David. It's an excellent birthday gift. Mary, how was your date with John? It's okay. It seems we have a lot in common. Oh, really? That is great news. What does he look like? He is tall and slim, fair-haired. Sounds like he is pretty cute. What do you think of him? He is a nice guy and very considerate. I am impressed with how smart and humorous. Oh, it's love at first sight. Hey, check out this new game I bought today. Wow, it's a trivia game all about the Academy Awards. I know you love the Oscars. This game has some great questions about all types of movies. Does it have questions about foreign language films? There's hardly any American films worth watching. Yes. In fact, one of the categories is on foreign language films. My mother and my wife are always holding different ideas. If you are really in love with your wife, you should be in support of her. You can't have it both ways, of course. You mean I should please her by following her suggestion? Yeah, love me, and love my dog. Have some more tea, George. No, thanks. I've really got to go now. Have a nice day. You, too. Are you interested in history? Yes, I am. I enjoyed studying it at school, though I had trouble remembering all the dates, so my teacher never gave me good marks. 
I love history, but I've always thought that learning the reasons behind events is more important than remembering exactly when they happened. I wish you had been my history teacher. I might have got better marks. Some people say that history repeats itself. What does that mean? The same events never happen twice, do they? The idea is that the people and dates change, but the reason why things happen stay the same. I see. I think I'd agree with that statement. People often seem to make the same mistakes over and over again. Our mission is to help you learn the English language. We have created easy to follow free educational materials for those seeking knowledge of English.